and I have a, a picture of when Mama got her, um, finally, when she got her citizenship papers, because my father got his and uh, before her, but he when he got them, he waited just a little bit too long, and it was too late for Mama, because if he got it in this period of time, then the wives, the spouses, were automatically uh, that's so right. naturalized. That's right, okay. but he didn't do that. Consequently, she had to go to night school, and she had to learn all the Pledge of Allegiance, all the things that are taught them a lot, quite a bit, quite a bit, in English. And then she got her naturalization paper, and it was during the war, because she was interviewed, and I'll show you the picture. And the newspaper, big picture, was in the newspaper because she had two sons in the service, and uh, she said she would never, uh, what, what were the words she said? Oh, she always bought war bonds every every year because of having two sons in the in the service. Yeah. Did she ever talk about what it was like having two sons uh, fighting a war against the Axis powers against oh, sure. uh, her her own country? Sure, what sure. was that attitude like? Did she sure. ever tell? Uh, hated. She hated. We hate, you know, hated the fact that uh, that Mussolini sided with Hitler. That was bad for all the Italians here. Nobody wanted that, and um, but unfortunately he did. However, they did also say some good things that, in fact, he was good for Italy before he went into this alliance with Hitler. True, in the 20s, he mm -hmm. built a lot of roads, a lot of hospitals. Even the school I attended was, uh, he uh, did yeah. the initiative to build the University for Foreigners. How he caved it. into Hitler's, you know, to that total, of course, he was pretty much then, too, a little bit of a, you know, what, what they call them, dictators. 